driving without headlights. It's a problem that has become uh, such a common mistake that Canada is now changing the way cars are made. In tonight's Project Drive Safer report, Rebecca Clough is showing us the new technology and what it means for drivers. A way too common occurrence, someone driving without their headlights on. They don't notice, I guess, that their lights are not. That was back in 2018 during a ride along with the Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office. We spotted a driver on the interstate who told the deputy they didn't realize their headlights weren't on. This is so common it has a name, phantom vehicles. It refers to vehicles that don't have their lights properly illuminated uh, at night, causing them to be kind of like ghost like cars and very dangerous. According to AAA, even though there are less vehicles on the road at night, more crashes happen at that time. Phantom vehicles have become such a problem. The Canadian government created a law to try to stop it. The reason Canada's transport minister says between daytime running lights and dashboards that automatically light up when it's dark, people make the air in assuming their headlights are on when they aren't. The U.S. is now benefiting from Canada's action because automakers are starting to create ways to default to having the lights on instead of off. The automaker Porsche has been doing something like this since 2017. And this year, that smart headlight technology is on almost every model. When we start a Porsche, the headlights are going to go to automatic. And even though you can turn your headlights off, the technology will not let them stay off if the car is moving. Yeah, once we start rolling and we hit six miles an hour, headlights, taillights, they're going to turn off. Nick Jarmus with AAA says they expect to see more vehicles coming out that comply with Canada's new standard. But he warns people keep their cars for a long time, so the problem with phantom vehicles will not go away quickly. Most uh, U.S. auto owners keep their vehicles for, for about 10 to 12 years before they trade into a new vehicle so that certainly there's a lag between when a feature is required and when we begin to really see a significant impact on the road. AAA says a good rule of thumb is to never assume your headlights are on. Every time you get into a vehicle, they say you should check, even if it means turning them off and then on, before heading out. Reporting in Waukesha, Rebecca Clough, TMJ4 News. All right, Rebecca, thanks. Hearing from you is a huge part of Project Drive Safer. So if you have an idea or a story, reach out to us. All you have to do is scan the QR code that's right on your screen right now. We will take you, and that will, I should say, take you to projectdrivesafer.com where you can send us a message.